What's up guys, JFM here back with another video. Today I'm coming at you guys with another episode for the Seeds for JFM project. Basically, this is a seed and it was sent in by Gilbert Villalon from Twitter. It's a very, very awesome seed as you guys can tell. And I wanted to start this one off from the actual seed, excuse me. I'll go ahead and show the generation and whatnot and how you get here, but I wanted to show you guys this is epic. It is literally a Mesa biome touching an ice spikes biome. It's one of the most uh I don't this has to be the most this has to be the rarest combination of biomes. It's crazy because ice spikes biome is super rare, the Mesa biome is super rare. Combine them both, that's that's pretty rare. So this is really awesome. Also, it does feature a few villages, which I will show um later on in the video, but I uh yeah, that's basically it. I just I'm super, super stoked that uh, this seed was sent in because it's just, it's just awesome. So thank you, uh, Gilbert Villalon. You uh, are definitely appreciated for your awesome, awesome contribution. So without further ado, let's go ahead and actually show the generation of the seed. So I'll just go ahead and delete these two worlds here because those are ones uh, that I was just messing around with, checking out the seed. Let's start it up so just go into new advanced enter the seed it's simple it's just 140 uh 513 1110 that simple just go ahead and add that make sure it is infinite and creative because that's how it's going to work so now we can generate the world and you may start off um Oh, you're gonna you're gonna start off uh, in this little grassland area, but go forward and you're going to see your first village. This has um, basically everything you need. No blacksmith, but it will start you off with a great amount of food for the journey you're about to take. Here is the Mesa biome, and oh, right, am I still on? No, I thought I was on the max render distance because that kills the recording. That kills it. Uh, but yeah, so if you want to go ahead and uh, follow exactly where I'm going. Basically, you're going to be able to find it. The easiest way uh, to find it without getting lost or having to climb these huge hills in survival is just go around and follow the desert all the way around the Mesa biome, but it is actually a little bit easier just to fly through it. <laughs> yeah, that's just the easier way on creative. So I'll go ahead and speed this up, and you guys will see exactly where I'm going, and I won't cut anything out, so you guys will not miss a single beat. Alright guys, so after going forward for quite a while, you will reach your ice spikes biome. Now, if you actually go around, the desert will wrap around the majority of it, and end right around over there, you will pass a few villages. I know for a fact a few of them do have blacksmiths, so that is uh, pretty cool if you're going the survival route. But the creative route, you just basically gotta fly forward, and eventually you will find this epic, epic mashup of some awesome, awesome stuff and it also occurs over there but i think it just looks nicer over here so it uh it is over there as well but it happens over here um for this short amount of time it's just awesome the mesa biome is absolutely huge the ice spikes biome is pretty big it's a lot bigger than the other ice spikes biome i've found but it's not even a fraction the size of the mesa biome although it is really really big so you're not gonna have any trouble having as much fun in here as as you wish it's really it's a really um it's a really great size for an ice spikes biome because usually ice spikes biomes are on the smaller side so i was pleased to see how big this one actually was and as you can see here it does actually touch up once again and it's uh it's loading here we go this is actually really interesting because it's kind of like on top of the mesa biome sort of how it's like it's literally overlapping over here it's kind of weird but it's pretty cool like there's snow and there's a mesa biome right there so it's pretty cool um but yeah that is basically this seed if you guys did enjoy a like would definitely be appreciated also be sure to find uh the person who did discover the seed his stuff will be in the description so you guys can go ahead and check him out thank him for this awesome contribution because it is definitely nothing to shrug off i hope you guys did enjoy this episode for this JFM Seed Project. I will talk to you all later. And as always, stay frosty, my friends. Peace, guys. See ya. 
Bye-bye.